Welcome to this Cessna 172 G1000 flight plan tutorial. To start press the flight plan button on the MFD. This brings up the flight plan page, it has already got my origin airport Echo Sierra Oscar Kilo. To begin with, I will program a departure. Select the procedure button and then use the FMS outer knob to scroll to select departure. I will be using the SIPSI 5 Charlie departure. Once selected press the enter button. Then press enter again to load it. This has loaded the departure into the flight plan window. To activate the cursor press the FMS knob inwards. Then scroll to the empty line. Here additional waypoints can be entered. Type the identifier of the waypoint letter by letter and then press enter. Press enter a series of times to commit the waypoint to the flight plan. Now, we don't want this waypoint, so I will show you how to delete it. To delete a waypoint make sure it's selected with the cursor and use the clear button to remove it. I will now select an arrival, this is done in a similar process to selecting the departure. But first I must enter the destination airport into the flight plan page Echo Sierra Golf Golf. Press procedure, and then select arrival. I select the Negil 3 Sierra arrival. Next, I will select an approach. Once again, this is similar but with more steps. I will select the ILS-21 with a Golf Golf for zero for initial approach fix. Minimums can be set. Now make sure to load the approach and not activate it. Activating an approach is done in flight. The flight plan can be checked by scrolling through the flight plan page. To save a flight plan, press menu and then store flight plan. Deleting a flight plan can be done in the same way. To load a flight plan which has been saved, go back to the main flight plan page. Deselect the cursor by pressing the FMS knob and then use the inner FMS knob to scroll to the next page. Then reselect the cursor and select the desired flight plan. The page will then disappear. Pressing the flight plan page will show the route has been loaded 